Western Youth Innovation Award was established by the Ontario Science Centre to encourage and recognize young Canadian innovators. Students aged 14 to 18 from across Canada are invited to profile how they have shown initiative and leadership to become agents of change by addressing a current issue they are passionate about. Entries are judged on the degree to which they demonstrate the key characteristics of innovation, those being inspiration, creativity, collaboration, risk-taking, and real-world problem-solving. But I am thrilled to announce that this year's winner of the Western Youth Innovation Award is Kimberly Gulovich from Fort St. John in British Columbia. to start looking I've really been interested in using waste products as alternative energy sources so I decided to look into methane capture when someone mentioned to me that Lagoons produce methane and once I started looking into it I realized that it was, would be a really good way to not only um, provide an alternative energy source but also methane is a, um, has 25 times the impact on the environment than CO2 does of the same mass so I realized that by having methane go into the atmosphere um, we're really be having a large effect on the environment so by producing by reusing that methane we were not only reducing our carbon footprint but also using alternative energy source My community came together so much. I had numerous, my entire sp project was sponsored. Layfield Environmental, Layfield Group, they sponsored the entire cost of my geo membrane cover, which was amazing. They just jumped right on board. But I had many, many businesses within my community volunteer man hours and ma volunteer supplies and equipment for me to completely install my system. So I I'm extremely thankful for, to my whole community. pursue the life of science and research and exploration that I've been part of. It continues to inspire Canadians today, and I take no more pleasure and pride in the things that Canada can do than when we have a chance, like today, in order to honor a young Canadian who's come up with a great idea. Up on the space station right now, there are six people living, and they have a sewage problem. <laughs> Thank you. 